and I was looking at the uh, when I was looking at the fight because it was near me. It was at the Fort Bend Epic Center, but I was like, I don't think I want to pay that to pay to see Keyshawn. Was it, was he he won he won he was how he he was the uh the main event. Nah, he wasn't the main event. And you know the yeah. top rank cards be. Yeah, that's that's probably why, cause he, he you know, it, they they probably the prices off. It was a Janabek fight. It was a Janabek yeah. fight. Yeah. See, this is the crazy thing about it. They they different people is worth a certain amount of money to different people. You see what I'm saying? Like you'll be like, okay, uh, this is, say Canelo for instance. This is a Canelo fight. Me, I wouldn't spend no 10, 20, 30, 40, whatever thousands to sit in on front row to see Canelo, but to somebody else is is worth that. You know what I'm saying? Cause they 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 they're more of a fan. You know what I'm saying? I don't even know if I yeah. even go to a Canelo fight. I wouldn't either. I wouldn't either. You know, I mean, listen, if it's Kobe, MJ, Barry Bonds, um, um a few forge fights back in the day. I'll spend some money, you know. Like I spent the whole, I spent dinner, my, my whole savings to, to see MJ play, and he was on the Wizards, and this mm -hmm. was in Sacramento, and he played half the game, but I didn't care because that's the type of, you know, that's what he demanded, right? I mean, that's Michael Jordan, and so it depends right. on the athlete and the person, what's your, you know, connection to that person. But Canelo, absolutely not, absolutely not. Hey, you see, you, yeah, you see what uh, Matt Perez say uh, now. Crawford talking about unity and boxing. Shake my head. C Crawford is a fraud. Man, I don't man. even know why he came out and said nothing. Like you, the hardest well, nigga to work with. Like, what are you talking vacation. about? Did y'all know that? Huh? Look at your He's face, Ross. You look disgusted. You look disgusted, Ross. Look at your face. Oh, <laughs> I, can't, I can't believe it because that dude Crawford is is uh is is man he. It, it, I like it, my it don't make when no I read that and roll my eyes like. And then he got to call Oscar. No he tried to call Oscar yeah. like respectfully Oscar. The boxers need to do it. Man, get out of here, hey, man. Crawford is like he. Crawford, don't nobody want to hear you, bro. I'm, I'm gonna keep it real. Probably one of your fans. So don't nobody want to hear you. We that that's just like when they when they have a a, a, a black comedian is supposed to be a spur, spokesperson for all, the whole black community. They have a comedian or an athlete instead of a real activist. You see what I'm saying? To talk about real problems in the neighborhood, they have some 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 uh comedian or some fake reverend like uh Al Sharpton or some stuff or some um uh, fake nigga like uh uh, uh Jesse Jackson or uh. They have um um Colin Kaepernick or something like they the spokesperson for the black community. No, 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 no. They need a Malcolm X. They avoid they avoid them Malcolm X niggas. They avoid them at all costs. They avoid them. That's talking real. They want somebody they could they could just pay and sugar and they could sugarcoat that stuff, man. Um, they they need somebody else talking besides um Terrence Crawford, man. That belt went to that nigga head. That undisputed went to that nigga head. He wanted to jump to 168, 154. Uh he wanna say who he go fight, who he ain't go fight. Boy, you 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 whack sauce, man. You cheated, first of all. Second of all, you don't sell no tickets. We ain't believing nothing you saying, and you're not the smartest person. After after uh uh, uh Bob Aram did him dirty, did him bad. Bob Aram was talking all kind of crazy stuff about this dude. And what he do? Sign right back to him. Terrence Crawford is a hundred percent typical house nigga. That's that's how I look at him. A house nigga, straight up. On I was on IG last night and uh, just rolling through, and he's in he's in Belize right now, vacationing, spending that Errol Spence money. So he, I mean, he's like he's having a good time out there. Just you know, yeah. You know, Enjoy yourself. Yeah. Do all that stuff, but yeah. stop making comments like you the spokesperson for he black. Needs to be mafia. quiet. Though. I agree. Yeah, yeah. 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 He needs to be quiet right now. That stuff ain't making no sense. Like this nigga, the, the spokesperson for black boxing. Yeah, especially when when. When you ain't been known for talking in the past, like listen, don't switch up because you didn't get all the belts and then you beat Spence and then now you're talking, bro. Keep this other ring, keep doing what you've been doing is being quiet. You stay in Omaha, Nebraska. You're training camp. You feeding the kids, whatever. Keep doing that. But and and Ross, you know me. I like Terrence Crawford. You know that. 
but all this talking and stuff, bro, I don't like that. Because now he's trying to switch up who he is to me. I don't like that. Yeah. Um the nick the nigga whack as hell. Uh he need to uh he need to try to find out how he go cycle off that juice again. But he unfortunately, did. but unfortunately, he can be whack and all these things, and, and we can both agree on that outside the ring. But unfortunately, he's judged what he does inside the ring, and he's pretty damn good at that. Right? I mean, that's all that matters to me, honestly. And that's with any boxer. He, right? He, he, he's not a Muhammad Ali. <laughs> not <in the> same. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now, if it was Muhammad Ali, then, you know, Muhammad, I, I'll go with Muhammad Ali. But all these other boxers is whack. Look look at this stuff. Uh, they, they all whack, man. They all whack. They with the system. They with the program. Terrence Crawford. Uh, you know, he, he, I, all his, to me, all his wins is, uh, should be, uh, overturned. I just believe it. All his wins should be hey, overturned. Overturned? Overturned all of them. That nigga Ooh. been cheating for a long time, man. When you get, go back and look at these gloves and these tactics, these cheating tactics they use, and then the Boxing Commission sitting right there over them, looking at them do this stuff, man. You know what I'm saying? The Boxing Commission need to be 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 overturned. They should have cameras. They should have multiple cameras, and the cameras are programmed to, if they do certain things, you see what I'm saying, it automatically uh, 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 say cheating or this or that or don't do that. Or, you know what I'm saying? Because you got people that know the rules and they send watching you just blatantly cheat. You dig, dig what I'm saying? So when you're dealing with people with money, there's always going to be some corruption. They need some type of automatic cameras that say Terrence Crawford cheating, squeezing gloves, squeezing gloves, no squeezing gloves, no squeezing gloves, no squeezing gloves. And you know what I'm saying? Straight up. They, that's what they need, cause you, you got them niggas was standing right there looking at them do the stuff and wasn't saying nothing. So, you know what I'm saying? So he could, they could have been cheating for a long time, man, a super long time. I, I just, I just don't, you know, I don't care about if I lose, I lose, fan square. There ain't nothing wrong with that. You dig what I'm saying? You tried your hardest, they tried their hardest, but but you know somebody got to lose, somebody got to win. So you know what I'm saying? But to be cheated is kind of like, you know what I'm saying? It's bad, man. It's bad. It's yeah, bad. That's most, yeah, that's a bold statement to to say that you want all his fights overturned because all of them. You gotta go back to all, all of them and 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 you know dissect and you know uh, all of them dissect them. Then let's dissect. Let's get the cut. Take away they wins too because let's take away Floyd's half his fights because he was doing because he was using cheating tactics too. You know, nah, uh, what, what cheating tactics was he using, brother? You show the elbow picture of Terrence Crawford, but we know Floyd landed yes. the elbow. Floyd, Floyd on, no, 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 no. Floyd pushed him off. He pushed him off. Does, I'm pushed. It doesn't matter. He still, he's, it doesn't, he's, no, 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 no. It's a different You got in boxing? That and this. You see this? Uh -huh. no, no, this yeah, is I got you, man. That is a, a land. Like, oh, I, I know, but but is it illegal to lead with your elbow? To lead? He's not leading with the elbow. He used to put the elbows. He used to. Shell up. He, no, no, no. He he do like this. He keep them off. This it's a it's a difference. No, it's a difference. No, it's a difference. They they come in. He keep them off. Floyd Floyd didn't hit him with the elbow, bro. It's a difference. You you pushing them off. It's a complete difference. Oh, Would you? Man. Is it like somebody got a fist and they do like this and they just push you back opposed to okay. that? It's it's a complete difference. He he keeping them. At distance, they too close, head butts and stuff like that. He ain't hitting them with elbows, man. That's it's a complete difference. Since we're talking about elbows, and Mr. Mars want to bring it up, let me show you some of these elbows this young man did. Yeah, Mr. Mars, man. Let's let us let us let us show y'all some of these elbows that, that this guy did. Floyd didn't do that. Oh no, 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 he didn't do that. He didn't do that. Did that Floyd Floyd elbows more in your chest, pushing you off. He pushed you off. This dude is elbowing you in the neck and in your jaw. And and, and he using it as, as a punch. That's what what punch would you call that? The eighth punch, the team nah, I can with I call eleven that left hook and the follow through comes with the elbow and spins mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, the elbow. No, ain't no ain't no elbow to follow through. No, 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 no. Oh, they if, if the elbow was supposed to be the follow through, they should have they should have put a pad on. They should put a glove on your elbow. You need an elbow glove then if it, if it was meant to follow through. Why you only got 
gloves on your hands because your hands the only thing that's supposed to hit that person in the face. If they want the elbows to hit niggas in the face, they they they, they, they had uh, uh, gloves on the elbows. So should we overturn all of Bernard Hopkins fights? Yeah, overturn all that nigga fights. Okay, overturn cool. if that's how you feel, overturn all that nigga fights. We nope, can... nope, because you know why? Because there wasn't no juice involved. So when when I'm saying overturn fights, I'm not saying overturn fights because of elbows. We understand that the elbows that happen, you go do some sneaky stuff up in there, you go throw low blows, elbow, you go do some stuff hitting on the hips and thighs and stuff like that. That's that's what's gonna happen. You dig what I'm saying? Do it's supposed to happen? No. You dig what I'm saying? Do they supposed to uh, take a point? Yes, they do. They go warn them, then they supposed to take a point. But at the end of the day, when you using juice, overturn everything. As uh, uh, was was the execution of using juice. Shout out to Sin Box and dropping that deuce on your boy. Say put some color in the chat. Support the TBO chat. You did. Hey, um, was 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 was, was he used? Was uh, uh uh the executioner using juice? Is what we want to know. We don't know. We, we don't know. I mean, no speculations. I mean, I don't. I mean, nothing said he was using it, but we then again, we just don't know. We don't know. You don't know. Well, ain't yeah. nobody brought up he was using juice, so we're gonna say I, he's a he's I a fairly know. clean. Yeah, clean I, I, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, but check this out though. What homie said right here, he said, unless you do 24 7 365 testing, a fighter knows when to use and cycle off Roy's best results are when you taper off Roy's. It most definitely is. But you know what they call what Victor Conte say is 24 7 365 oh, yeah. testing is they're going to for in, in 12 months, they go test you six to ten times. That's it. Get that up out of here. Come on. That's crazy. Straight up. Straight up. That don't make no sense. Yeah, that don't make no sense. Mm, mm, mm. You only go test them six to ten times. That ain't even one time a month. Yeah, especially this right here by Xavier Jones. Um, uh, pinning from and moving your opponent with your firearms and elbows, Earl is one of the best. And see, that's where I had a problem at because Errol prides himself on getting inside, throwing body punches, being an elite inside fighter. And to let Terrence Crawford get all that dirty stuff off, shame on Errol Spence, man. Shame on him. Shame yeah. on Earl. Oh my goodness, shame yeah. on Earl. Yeah, to me, to me, shame on Earl, man. Because, because, because Ross and two cents. If Arrow and his team watched video and film of Terrence and they knew that Terrence was this dirty fighter, then they have to plan for that. Meaning when you get inside, you have to position your head a certain way. Like you, you have to plan for each other. That's why it's called watching film. And Derek James said on a few occasions, they didn't even watch film. This is great. This is crazy, man. I mean, okay. That's cool. uh, you know them niggas lying. You know Derek James yeah, lying. Know, yeah. I, you know, you, I you know he like that now. Now they be like, they don't be saying nothing about them. That nigga lying. Ain't they? They lying. Yeah, straight up. He, he straight lying. Straight up. Uh, uh, shout out Jay Mac, man. Salute, salute, salute. He dropped a deuce on the young channel. He said, "Excellent analyst." Yeah. Once you cheat, you ain't shh. <laughs> for real. <laughs> you get everything is in question after that. You have to prove you cheated, though. So, I mean, Terrence ain't proved he been cheated yet. So, I mean, what you're saying is true, but you have to prove somebody cheated first. And this so, for you, Mr. Moss, right here. Cool. This for you, right there. Miss Crawford has a fight with Tim Zoo or any other fight except EJ. How many pay per views does he think Bud will sell? Um, we listen, I think we all know that Terrence isn't the best seller. Um, if he fought Tim Zoo, how many would he sell? I don't know, probably around 200,000. But so what? Who cares? 200. I don't think he'd do 200. You think no, 200? I think 200. Yeah, I think. Well, yeah, with Tim Zoo, easy, easy at, at 154, I, move up in weight. Absolutely. I mean, how many uh pay per views had Tim Zoo ever sold? That doesn't matter. He's fighting at Terrence Crawford. So you got to put those Both of them don't sell nothing because one – so you get two people that don't sell and all of a sudden it well, sells. Well, 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 yeah, because he's going – he's moving up in weight. He's moving up in weight. People want to see him lose. He's finding a bigger, stronger guy, right? And so they're going to pay to see him probably lose per se. 
And so he can sell at least 200,000 easy.